Hi. 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 I'm so giddy. Today's subject is one that I adore. I believe in, I stand by, and I strive to perfect. Toiletries. I love my toiletries. Yes, traveling with liquids could be an issue, but not if you know the rules. All you have to know is that each individual bottle can only hold up to 3.4 ounces, and all of those containers have to fit in one quart size bag. Now the key to the perfect toiletry bag is not the bag, it's the containers in the bag. These are my all time favorites. They are by a company called Human Gear. I have the descriptions below to every container. And the reason I like them is because they have a wide mouth and that makes it easy to pour in liquids. Avoid funneling at all costs. What is this? So back to the one I like. It has squeezable material, so you can get the last drop of product out. And if everything fails, the wide mouth allows you to do the nice good old finger technique. The reason you want to avoid hard materials is because you can't really get the last bit out. And then you find yourself just pushing the bottle to try to get everything out. Another thing you want to avoid is corners. I recently found these. They have pretty good attributes. They are malleable, they have a good wide mouth, but they have corners. So I'm sticking to my good old round go-to. These I use for shampoo, conditioner, face soap, and body lotion. If you want to add an extra layer of protection, which I always do, here's what you use. Masking tape. Simply grab a piece, put it around your bottle, and voila, spill proof. And today they have so many pretty colors. For liquidy liquids, I like spray bottles. They are small, they economize the amount you use, and they are completely spill proof. These I use for my toner, my makeup remover, and my leave-in conditioner. On to jars. These I use for creamier products, things like face cream, eye cream, even toothpaste. These are pretty cool. You simply pop them open, done. I haven't had any spills, but I wouldn't put any liquidy liquids in them. These vials are for Q-tips. I need me my Q-tips. And now, cotton pads. I'm still on the hunt for the perfect container for cotton pads, so if you find one, you tell me. And finally, we have the miscellaneous. And that all goes in a see-through pouch. Simple, washable, easy to carry. All of that goes into my carry-on. I've never had a problem with security. This is the same kit I take whether I'm going to Paris or I'm going surfing. I always use the same products. Powdered shampoo, no thank you very much. Well, I hope you enjoyed it. And if you like these videos, don't forget to subscribe above. Like this video, comment below. I'm listening. What do you want me to talk about? See you next time. Bye. Psst. Hey, don't leave yet. Don't forget to subscribe.